let me start it. Oh, start it. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, you guys know what I'm gonna say. First off, thank you for all of the love and support you guys have been giving me, especially with so, some of my last videos. I didn't post over the holidays, so I kind of felt bad, so I'm kind of like super posting for you guys right now. But thank you so much for all the love you guys have been giving. If you're not already subscribed, pause this video and press subscribe down below. Along with that, um, hit the bell notifications link so you guys know when I'm posting a new video. I don't have like any specific order or days, so it always helps to know when something new goes up. Anyways, without further ado, you guys see who I have here with me. I use away. Uh, I have my boo boo head here with me today. You guys have been asking for me to post videos and stuff with him, answer questions, do things like that. So I thought it would be cool for today to do. The boyfriend tag so i've never done i've done the brother tag um but i've never brought a boyfriend on never had a boyfriend to bring on yeah it's one and only okay there ain't nothing coming after this oh, yeah i'm on my my joe vibes uh, stop, <laughs> creep. so today we're gonna do the boyfriend tag without further ado let's get into it first off if you guys are not following my boy Follow him, don't be annoying, and don't sign his DMs because I will, what's her name? What's it? Love. I will love you, okay? <laughs> so just follow him, support the pictures that he be posting and stuff, yeah. and say, I'm from Jaleesa's channel, blah, 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 yeah, say know. that. Anyways, um, okay, so we're gonna get right into it. I haven't done one of these before, so we might be a little bit like all over the place, but so be it. So babe, are you ready? That's good. Do you have anything to say to the people beforehand? Enjoy. That's it? That's all. Let's, let's see what happens. Okay. So I, I showed him like, so I have like a hundred questions or more on this screen. I did not know any of this. And I showed him like a glance at some of them, but of course it was too many for him to read. So he doesn't really know what's coming. Y'all are saying firsthand my reaction. Ask random ones. Okay, babe. The first one, where do we meet? Ha! Easy. We met at the club because she didn't want to hit me up when she was supposed to. So we where was I supposed to hit you up? We were, we were talking on Instagram, you know, it was supposed to be going, you know, the whole back and forth. I like a picture, you like a picture, you like two, I like two and all that. And then she unfollowed me. But yeah, we met at the club, so. You didn't slide fast enough, so Excuse there's me. that. Trying to be a gentleman. What were your first impressions of me? Oh, she fine. And then, <laughs> look, so when we first met, she came to talk to me. Cause I wasn't, I really wasn't talking to nobody, but she came to talk to me. And then when she walked away. I was trying to be hospitable, but we're not gonna was, do this. Which was, no, no, I'm just saying that you come, I'm telling them that you came to me. And oh, then okay. when she walked away, she had on this black dress. That so, was one of the questions. What did I wear when we first met? Well, it's gonna pop up again. And when she walked off, like, I didn't know she was, you know, <laughs> I didn't know I was back there, but. That dress showed it, so yeah, she was deep. Anyways. That's my impression. Oh, I, I guess that's was the honest. Fine and thick. Honest. Yeah, guy exactly. Okay. Jeez. What is my favorite food? Your favorite food? Well, that really depends. Well, actually, no. Wings. Okay. Hi, that works. What's my middle name? She has two. You want, you want both? The first one. You mean? Eugenia. It's from my grandfather. You guys already know this whole story. My grandfather's name is Eugene. So my middle name is Eugenia. My brother's middle name is Eugene. There's that. Complete the sentence with one word. My girlfriend is... Goat. The goat. Oh, the so goat. <laughs> what was the first thing you gave me? Hmm. First thing I gave you? Was it a candle? It was a candle. It was a candle. So, mini story behind that. So, we were dating or whatever. And this is before we were like together and stuff. And he came over once and saw that my candle was like low. And the next time I saw him, he had went to Bath and Body Works and got me a new candle and said, I saw that your candle was about to burn out, so I got you a new one. Ladies love Bath and Body Works candles. And men don't sleep. We also got, love like, men that pay attention. Yeah, yeah. And I never mentioned anything about me running out of candles or anything like that. So like that was one of the things that got me. Y'all go like, get that really... mahogany teak wood. No, babe, you can look this. 
What well, men go through the mahogany teeth good? Uh, where was our first date? Our first date was pedicures. Okay. What would I prefer on a date? Netflix and chill or wine and dine? How well do you know me? Can you mix them? Oh, Netflix and chill first? and wine. Oh. Okay. <laughs> what is your pet name for me? Ah, she's so tell, many. Tell the got, world. Well, first you got twin because she just wants to be like me. Where did twin come from? Because literally when we first started talking, it was like everything I would say. She was like, oh, me too. Or she would say something. I was like, yeah, dang, me too. So she was really just trying to be like me. And obviously I was here on this earth first. So she's even a Capricorn, which is why we really literally the goats. But yeah, twin, uh, stink, stinky booty. Boo boo head. Boo -boo -head. Um, we like adopt each words. other's nicknames. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's how she got a lot of these guys. That's what she calls me. What did you think the first time you met my parents? Uh, I thought it was cool, really. Like she thought it was gonna be like overwhelming. It really wasn't. It that was bad. overwhelming. I was sweating. I was hot. She I don't was more introduce than people I was. to my parents. She was really more nervous than I was, and we went. We went to eat. That was the first time I met him, huh? We went out to eat. Well, you yeah, came so to the house first. Yeah, I came to the house, but we ended up going out to eat, and we couldn't even really tell it was the first time meeting him. So they were, they were real chill. Somebody was overly confident. I was nervous. <laughs> I was freaking out. Oh, what was I wearing on our first date? Oh, well, that's easy. She had on this all gray, all gray workout clothes, really. And she had a braids. Like she has now? I did have the braids, they just weren't as long. All gray. That's true. With her Gucci slides on. Okay. This one may require a little thinking. All right, all right. What is one thing you've learned since being in a relationship with me? Hmm. I'll give you a second. One thing I've learned. Mm -hmm. Take your time, boo boo, it's okay. <laughs> all right let's see here to let you like do you as in the whole giving thing because we're okay. both we both like to would rather give than receive so when she would try to do like above and beyond i would try to stop her but now kind of like okay this is what she likes to do so just let her do it so yes agreed so we're both Capricorns. We're very independent. We like doing our own thing, having our own stuff, not needing anybody or anything like that. So we both have that trait. But with that also being said, we're also both extreme givers. So when we first started dating, like I would be doing all this stuff like cooking and he was, he had a mini surgery. Minor, very minor. A minor surgery and like couldn't even like do anything. And I was trying to like pretty much take care of him and he kept fighting me off. Well, this was the first time that I like legit got mad at him because I was like, like, you're not letting me help and all this kind of stuff. And I called my mom and I was like, I mean, this is the beginning of us, you know, being together and talking and doing all this stuff. But like, he doesn't understand this is how I show love, like all this kind of stuff. So this was like the first time I was legit mad at him. And this was the first time I was legit mad at him. So like, it was a thing. But I kind of told him, like, this is how I show love and this is how I express, you know, how I feel about you. And you're not letting me do that. So then that's where that statement came from. What is my Starbucks order? Your Starbucks order is black coffee with a shot of was it, caramel? Mm -hmm. Caramel. A shot and caramel. A shot and caramel. Well, so, they know what I be talking about when I say it, so yeah. I just say it and they know what I he say. He used to get so confused because I would be like, I want caramel in it, but I want a shot. But they would be like, we don't have caramel coffee. Mind you, I don't drink coffee. I don't go to Starbucks. So that. anything that they say, I'm just like, You're yeah, try that. One and, day, though, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay. What's my favorite snack? So her favorite snack is chips what kind with of chips? What hot kind of sauce, chips? kettle. And they have to be folded. They can't be the flat ones. They gotta be folded. I so she will go pick, pick through the bag, ooh, a folded one, and put it on the plate. And then put her Frank's hot sauce on it. Good. 
What series am I obsessed with? On Netflix? <laughs> anyway. <Or is> Grey's. <laughs> Grey's Anatomy. And then she tried to get me to watch it, which it has like 20 I seasons. I tried to get him to start from season one, episode one. You can't really understand. Because you don't really understand Meredith. I, Meredith I tried. I really, I really tried. Until you understand why she is the way she is and like know who Derek was. It's too much to catch up on. And then when you I watch, when we're watching it, she just she acts like it's her first time seeing it. Like, oh my gosh, that <laughs> happened! Everything. What? Like, like she tears. doesn't know what's about to happen. <laughs> what is my favorite time of the year? O M G! It's Christmas. <laughs> like literally Christmas. We watch the Grinch literally, no lie, at least thirty times. So Christmas decorations, the tree goes up. The day after Thanksgiving. No, baby. Decorations. The day after Halloween. Oh, yeah. Oh, my bad. Yes, the day after Halloween. <laughs> yeah. Decorations, all that. As soon as you open the door, it's a little chime that's like music and all that. Really? Basically. All right, you wait till next Christmas. <laughs> okay, we have a date. Do I prefer hiking and mountain climbing or dinner and drinks? So we going to dinner and drinks. The only hiking we doing is up some steps. <laughs> we don't make us sound lazy. I mean, we're not lazy. We, we're definitely active. Oh, this is Miss Fabletics over here. We know you ain't lazy. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Shop with the link below, guys. You did. Do I wear contacts or glasses? Both. We're blind over here, honestly. Like, blind, blind. Like, I cannot even operate a vehicle without glasses or contacts. Like, it's not even an option. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Okay. What do I do in my job? What do you do at your job? Your influence, which means you give hope. <laughs> Sell products. Uh, inspire. Mm -hmm. How would you describe my style? Style? So on an everyday basis, which is like one of the main things I like about her, she's like real chill. Like, she'll just basically be wearing sweats every day unless we really got to get dressed and go somewhere, which is exactly like me. I'm always in sweats or hoop gear. But when we get ready to go somewhere, she'll dress it up real nice. So, she got style. What date is my birthday? January 15th, Capricorn. Like, yeah. Describe me when I'm really tired. Like, when I'm tired, tired. She turns into a big baby, like really. Really? See, see, no, this, this, they ask for the truth. <laughs> we tell them the truth. She turns into a big baby. Wow. If we're laying down, she'll just come in. Snuggle or how babies want attention. That's okay, this is my big baby. But yeah, that's when she's tired. What about you when know? I'm hungry? When she's hungry, it's basically the same. Like, you know, Skin. or she's she'll, really she'll, she'll try to tell me try to convince me that I'm hungry. <laughs> so we should go get what? something to eat. Like, babe, you're not you're not hungry. Aren't you hungry? And yeah, so. I, I don't agree yeah, with that. Yeah, yeah, I'm hungry. Let's go. What's one food I don't like? Uh, food? Mm -hmm. What is that? So we finally got stumped. I'm probably gonna know it. So I don't even said. know. See. Um, something that I don't like. Cheese, anything? No, I don't. Eat muscles. I don't like cottage cheese. Mm -hmm. I don't like yogurt. Well, if you saying stuff like that, and we no, could throw in something, we could throw in the uh, eggnog. Ooh, eggnog see, really makes me I was thinking it drinks, up. but see, I mean that counts. So yeah, eggnog. What's your favorite thing about me? My favorite thing is she communicates very well, like very well, eliminates a lot of problems. If she has an issue, she would just actually come in and ask me. Get. Come she, here. she would actually come in and ask come me here. about it or like what's going on instead of being upset. So, you know, I practice that in therapy, guys. So. If you want to be a great communicator, go to therapy. Please. Figure out how to do so. Please. Um, I'm not I think looking. That was it. Oh. oh, perfect. That I wanted to ask. Uh, what's my weirdest habit? Hmm. 
Well, since I'm not a coffee drinker and she is, her is drinking coffee every day and putting nothing in it. Straight black coffee. Hey, stop. You like your man? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. But yeah, that's fine. And I have to like, I have to have it like. <laughs> <laughs> um, if I was collecting anything, what would it be? These are purses. You know, guys, I've been really having a thing with purses lately. So, yeah. He's like 100% from the field. Put me in, coach. Okay, guys. I think those were the majority of the questions that I wanted to ask. If you guys have... Actually, you want to ask me something? I can't do it right off the back, so... Oh, yeah. Please oh. hold. Okay, baby. You ready? Ready. So, when and where was our first kiss? Our first kiss was... In your kitchen during our wine night. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm, what color are my eyes? Your eyes are brown. <laughs> mm -hmm, okay. Are they? Okay. Oh, wow. She doesn't yes. look me in my eyes. <laughs> when and where did you meet my mom? Okay. <laughs> so, there's a story. So, I am at a pool party over the summer. I am at a pool party and I'm just, you know, kicking it, chilling with my friends, you know, had a few drinks. It was a great little chill situation. His mom shows up to his house. She just be popping up on She me. literally just pops up. So he's like, yeah, she's here, blah, blah, blah. And I, I was gonna go hang out with him after and she was there, so I'm like, I need to, and he, I guess, did you tell her that I was, that I was coming? Uh, I mean, after you said that you were going to come, I was like, yeah, Right. She's coming. Well, long story short, I was like, I'm in a bathing suit. I cannot meet her this way. So I literally left the pool party, went home, changed, and came. And that's how his mom met me after a pool party. She was in so a scared. change of clothes. I was, was freaking so out. Scared. I was sweating. I can't meet I her right like, now. I can't meet her like this. I was like, I can't now. meet her like this. <laughs> this is crazy. Now, she's my BFF. They talk more than I talk to her. Like, oh yeah, just talking to your mom. What? Um, that's how I be Have you talked to your mom so today? Please. Oh yeah, she just came from the store. So? Anyway, who said I love you first? You did. Oh. You did. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Uh alright, one more. One more. Do two more. more. Oh, two more? Okay, okay. What's my shoe size? The most annoying size ever because I like to buy gifts and I always try to buy him stuff and it's so hard to get stuff in his size. He wears a size 16. Welcome to my world. A size 16 shoe. So like I have to like really dig deep to find him a good pair of shoes. Thanks, no, up. no. What TV show do I like that you hate? First take. Okay, okay. First take every single morning. Every single morning. Like clockwork. Gotta catch up on my news. All you hear is Stephen A. Smith screaming his neck off. <laughs> hmm. What is my weirdest interest? This is a good one, because I want to know what she has to say. Your weirdest interest. I, I'm not going to say it's like a, a, a specific interest, but he always knows like really random facts. So I could be like, babe, tell me something. And he's like, did you know kangaroos have two pouches? I mean, since he did say And when I say tell me was, something, I'm like, tell random. me something about us. Shout out to Clint like, Ugh, please. Yeah. Tell me something about us or like, tell me how much you love me. He's like, yeah, did you know that on the spaceship there were like extra cabins? Oh, so for the last what? one. What? For the last one, this is like off the rip we're about to see if she remembers uh -oh. what instruments did i play <laughs> um, 
Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I played the baritone. I was about to say the trombone. Yes, yes, she was all off. I really only played in middle school, just Becky, so I could- I can't hear you over him talking. I mean, squeaking. I played in middle school and just so I could go to Six Flags at the end of the year. Did you go to Six Flags? I got in trouble both times, so <laughs> the Six Flags trip did not happen. And But I knew how to play the baritone. Which so I you were a remember. bad kid? No, it wasn't my fault. Why, how did you get in trouble both times? I mean, if we really want to get into this, somebody hit me with a mallet <laughs> and I hit them back. And obviously I was the one that got caught. And it was the week before Six Flags, so I was heated. Both, I was there all times. year. I don't remember what I did the first year. I'm pretty sure that was my fault either. But yes, eighth grade <laughs> wasn't my fault. <laughs> Is that your last one? That was the last one. Okay, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you guys have video requests from us, from me, he doesn't have his own channel, but he could do videos on mine. If you guys have special requests of videos, let us know. I love you guys. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you're following me on Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter. I tweet and stuff now. Follow me on <laughs> Follow me on there. I love you guys. Peace out.